What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. So we have left Denver, as you saw, we've been driving a little bit, and we have made it to Wyoming. It is gorgeous out here. Different terrain than I've ever seen. Some horses over there in the distance. So here we are. Are we good? more driving we have officially made it to Laramie we are here so we're gonna take a couple pictures then head in go check out the visitor center after the visitor center I think we're gonna explore the town a little bit go to the uh, spectacle emporium um, and then walk around downtown so cool I'll take you along for the ride So we went and got checked in at the little visitor center and I ended up getting a ticket for the dinner. Wasn't really expecting that. Kind of thought I was gonna be on my own for the night. So now I get to enjoy a nice little steak dinner. Glasses here. Oh no, I get the little nose one. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> you can either keep, the tag, either keep the tag or we teach you how to say hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I love it. Oh, oh my gosh. So you can't breathe. <laughs> there you go. That is so oh, fun. That's, oh, that's a good one for you. <laughs> you want me to, I can These catch you all if you want me to, too. How do they breathe them? <laughs> Yeah. That's the one. That's perfect. <laughs> that was a good we'll have to get here. Me and you can get one together. There we go. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. So 
that was Steve, the owner of the Spectacle Emporium, just telling some old tales about the town, a little bit of history behind Laramie, kind of just giving us an overall sense of uh, just the town. It's really cool out here. It's a nice, beautiful day, that is for sure.
Um, unfortunately, my camera died halfway through. I don't know, if, the battery didn't ever say it was low. So I'm kind of thinking that it was one of those cheap batteries I bought from Amazon. So anyway, headed to the little Q&A now, and uh, yeah, get some clips in there. All right. What's name? Michael Gibney, G I B N E Y. Gibney, 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 Gibney. There you go. Uh, yeah, there you are. There I am. And that's your ticket. That's my ticket. That's your ticket. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Can y'all hear me? Yes. Okay. Um, I don't know how many of you know me. Um, I know a lot of you have have communicated on Facebook before. Um, I was, I'll, I'll do a little brief history of myself. I was born and raised in New England, moved to Arizona in 1969. It's been a few changes since I moved. Um, have always loved the West. And Laramie um, was one of my favorite TV shows, but John has always been my absolute, unquestionably favorite actor. And I sat by the door. <laughs> <laughs> the interesting part of it is, that chair, after I got to know him, was never there again. He had put that chair there for me purposely. I was away from him, and he sat on the other side of the room purposely, which, which he was he he wanted he he was making me he was making me feel secure. Um, there's no doubt in my mind about that. And I sat down and I said, we need to go to lunch. <laughs> and he just kind of said, what? We really need to go to lunch. I haven't eaten all day and we went to lunch. Partly for conserving days. Um, and he had really good timing. Um, as a person that's ridden horses all my life, I noticed things. And he had really, really good timing. He just seemed to know when to release, when to tighten up, when to get out of the horse's way, when to get into the horse. And he was soft and uh, pretty easy on a horse. And Alamo was just amazing. He was, he was an incredible horse. So he bought Alamo from John Wayne, by the way, for those of you that don't know. And his name was Alamo because he was in the movie The Alamo. Is that enough? Let's follow up on no. I don't know, anyway, it doesn't matter. And J. Carol Nash. John did not really care much for J. Carol Nash. For a very good reason. Because in the movie there is a whipping scene. Because John is a very, very, very despicable character. Okay. Okay. And there's a whipping scene in that movie that is just horrible. And I remember... Oh, thank you. Really, really, guys, I thank you so much for caring about John. I really, I mean, I know you all love Bob. I love Bob, too. He's a dear friend. Um, I thank you for not forgetting John, because he was a very, very, very special man. And um, it means a lot to me to have all of you here. Believe me, thank you so much. Well, that was pretty cool. I had worn a little magnet, as you saw at the, uh, the John Smith question and answer session. So it was pretty cool.